Hello YouTube friends and welcome to my channel. Today I have for you a brother knife. The model number is 1503 and this is one of uh, their first what I would say uh, high-end or premium uh, quality knife that uh, they released. Uh, they were released in 2019 at around uh, June. Previously, uh, if you know uh, the company, uh, they are producing uh, mostly OEM uh, for uh, lots of companies, like also, for, if I'm not mistaken, for Spyderco. The, the bird line is made by, by them. They also have their own uh, knife uh, brands. They are selling uh, lots of uh, designs. They, if, I don't know if, uh, if they have uh, permission they are using uh, from Spyderco. Probably not, but I'm not here to make politics, of course, so it is up to them. But uh, some of those uh, traditional knives they made in past are are really really nice, and I featured, if I'm not mistaken, two here on my channel. Just check out my playlist. So now it is time to check out this new offering. It comes a really nice uh, cloth pouch. This is how it came, so in a plastic bag and it is oiled up, so let me clean this. So I will just wipe it down. Okay, so here we have it. I wanted to just to show you how it comes right from the factory, from the box that you can see. Uh, so it has a long pull, really, really, because it is a liner lock has a, a really smooth action so you can see there really really there is no half stop of course so let's wipe it down a little bit more they also have a name for the knife it, uh, they call it cowfish um, it looks like they are uh, have serial numbers. One five zero three, and there is also a designer, so one ton. Mm. <laughs> Interesting name, so one ton design. Also first time, and uh, there is a brother, and also first time uh, they are using premium, for for them premium of course, VG10, because uh, in the past they used only 440C, if I'm not mistaken, or, or 420. So overall, excellent executed. It has uh, stainless steel shield with nice carbon fiber inlays paint construction of course stainless steel bolsters and liners and yeah the, the smoothness is wow it's extremely smooth extremely smooth so Let's see the 
uh, the specifications. So we have an O length of uh, 15.9 centimeters or 6.26 inches. The blade length is uh, 6.75 centimeters or 2.6 inches. The blade uh, thickness is 3 millimeters or 0 0.12 inches. The blade width is 1.5 centimeters or 0 0.59 inches. The blade, like I mentioned, is made out of uh, VG10 with a hardness of 60 to 61 HRC. The handle length is 9.1 centimeters or 3.6 inch. The blade thickness, sorry, the handle thickness is 1.15 centimeters or 0 0.45 inches. The handle width is 2 centimeters or 0 0.78 inches. And the handle is made out of stainless steel and carbon fiber. It has a backlog. Uh, as a locking system and the weight is 75.7 grams or 2.7 ounces nicely polished not to a mirror but we have a sheep's foot profile with a false edge And let's see the sharpness out of the box. Nicely sharp. I feel a little bit of uh, dragging there, but very nice. Okay, so for let's see the size comparisons first. So this is, or uh, this was one of probably one of the most best-selling uh, brother knives, the 1501 G. Which is of course this one. Four forty C. This is a much larger. So combines the classic gentleman's folder with a new modern uh, design. Uh, so let's see mm, the case tribal. Probably one of my favorite case knives that I own. Then, of course, we have a standard toothpick from case. Then I have here the Wright and Sons. The model is Etric. And the Frost Cutlery Steel Warrior Range Rider. And let's also sneak in some other non-traditional uh, knives like the Tucson knives 111 small reptilian from Benchmade CRKT PLR large Kershaw shuffle one Shuffle two, pillar one, or just pillar spider called Delica. Mm, let's see. Bug Vantage, small.
So yeah, brother is making here with this knife a really beautiful traditional carry for a affordable price. I will almost compare this uh, with high-end production like with this case the the smoothness is almost like it would be some kind of custom beautifully executed it's very smooth and the best thing of course about it is the price so the full price is uh, $64 but the $64 uh, you're usually not paying uh, like we like everybody knows <laughs> because uh, the resellers will have a huge discounts so just check out Aliexpress uh, eBay you will probably find them uh, readily available uh, as the months progress Well, what 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 much more to say? I am really impressed with uh, with this offering from brother. I have not expected this. Yes, and also a big thanks uh, to my friend Joe, who did point me out uh, to check out this model. And yeah. Excellent work, my friend. Beautifully executed knife with lots of great features, like the materials, of course. The blade shape, yeah, the blade shape is also what I really like. Yeah, there is not a single flaw on this knife. Okay, so thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please feel to comment down below. If you are a subscriber, thank you very much. If you are not, then suggest uh, subscribing to my channel. I try to publish at least three videos per week, mostly knives and gear uh, related. Also, uh, I try to, to put out more content about uh, about miniatures, gaming uh, content like like Warhammer lore and stuff, books, previews, and also tools for the hobby. So if you have uh, interest in these kind of things, you will uh, you'll find uh, videos regarding these uh, topics here on my channel in the future. And also uh, check out my playlists. I try to organize stuff that you can check out. Uh, if you are interested in, in uh, budget oriented knives or maybe high end knives, I try to cover the wide spectrum of uh, the production uh, within this hobby. So, thanks for watching, and as always, have a nice day. See you soon. Bye.